Hi everybody, I'm Boaz Faller and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for Saturday, March 5th, 2016. So today the Moon is in Capricorn, it's sextiling Mars at around 1500 hours Central European time, that's around 900 hours Eastern Standard Time America, bringing a lot of uh, energy into the Saturday, bringing some vigor, being, bringing assertivity, allowing us the energy to take things forward in our life and uh, really working our lower chakras as well. There's a quincunx to Sirius at the same time suggesting that we should be more careful with our relationship with other women in our lives today and really uh, pay attention and try to be more feminine ourselves, softer, more intuitive and not so uh, masculine. And the sextile to Mars really gives it an added importance. The Moon uh, uh, goes into Aquarius at around 17.30 Central European Time, that's around 11.30 Eastern Standard Time, bringing all these Uranian energies, New Age energies, cerebral energies, focusing on our future. If we are doing, uh, if we are involved in activities today or we're planning ahead today, my tip for you is stay centered and, and stay grounded and walk in baby steps forward, really keeping your goals down to earth and not being extravagant or too naive or optimistic and setting goals that you cannot reach later on. Mercury, the planet of our thoughts and our words and our navigation through this universe enters Pisces today. And it's, it's doing that squaring Mars. First of all, this is a dangerous time on the roads. It's a dangerous time for accidents, both physical and verbal. And it's not the greatest time to really plan your life ahead. When Mercury enters Pisces, he's a bit lost there. And there's a cluster of, of planets in Pisces right now. And I'm talking about the whole uh, next month, the whole month of March really uh, bringing a lot of emotion to places that should have been more cerebral uh, cere oh, sorry more cerebral and 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 more um, mind oriented so we have to understand that our navigation through the universe and our thoughts and our our um, our mental processes are very much influenced from uh, our hearts from emotion, by emotion, and by things that are not necessarily, uh, that not necessarily need to be influencing our thought processes that much. This is really a time that the universe calls us to go back inside into our own inner womb, in a sense, and ask ourselves the deepest questions. Where are we going? Why are we going there? Is this right for us? And we can see during this period, you know, all this cluster stands in opposition to Jupiter, talking about expansion and broadening our horizons and development. And we could see ourselves changing. And it, please allow yourself to change at this time. And allow your surroundings and people that surround you to change as well. We could see people and activities moving away from our lives, making room for new things to come in and we could see new people and new information coming in teaching us, expanding our horizons and really making us different human beings in the process. So, thank you for listening. Have a positive weekend and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye bye.